If you're someone like me, then you're constantly reading books, you're listening to podcasts, you're watching videos on just exactly how you can level up your life and reach those six figures or even a million dollar earnings. We've heard all of the gurus say that you need to have multiple streams of income. The hair business is one of the most lucrative and profitable businesses that you can invest your money into. Doing research, finding hair vendors, Buying classes, they can be super duper overwhelming and expensive. So lucky for you, in today's video, I'm going to be dishing out all the 411 on how you can start a hair business for only $100 or less. So if you're into that, grab your notebook, grab your pen or your pencil, and let's get into it. Welcome and welcome back beauties. It is Kayla, your favorite beauty educator. And we're here with private label extensions. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing all of the information on how you can start your own hair business for only $100 or even less. I know, I know what you're thinking. Kayla, you're crazy. It's impossible to start a hair business for under $100, right? Mm, the good news is that is possible, okay? and our clients do it daily. It's really not that hard, but know that instead of putting in money, you will need to put in hard work and a lot of time. Hey, you can't have the best of both worlds regarding business, especially starting out. In the description bar, we are gonna drop the link to a well-detailed video by Mikey, our CEO from Private Label, as he shares his tips on how you can get your hair business started for under $100 in just 25 minutes. But I'm gonna give you guys some tea as well in under 25 minutes. So grab a glass of wine, a pen, and some paper and get ready to take some notes. Are you ready to get started? In this video, I'm gonna discuss three stages of starting your own hair business on a budget. Number one, we're gonna talk about the necessary items that you need to pay for to get your hair business up and running, but still look professional. Number two, we're gonna talk about the three things that you can do for your hair business to get it started and help with marketing. Number three, we're gonna discuss the optional paid tools, services, or marketing ideas for your hair business to take it to the next level when you're launching or be better when you're marketing. Okay, so here are the necessary items that you need to purchase. There's just no way around these, especially if you wanna look professional. So first, you wanna register your domain name. It's only $15 and you're gonna utilize the website godaddy.com. Having a professional domain name is where you will put your website. Selling on social media, it can work as well, but you need a home for your business, which will be your website. You're also gonna need a professional email address. This only costs $5 and you're gonna utilize Google Workspace. I wonder why more small business owners don't get a professional email for their business. Imagine if you ordered hair extensions from private label extensions and got an email from private label extensions at gmail.com instead of orders at private label extensions.com. Doesn't that sound better? You're also gonna wanna sign up for a Shopify account. This is only $29.99 on shopify.com. There are so many different e-commerce platforms, but Shopify is simply the best. They have excellent customer service, they have great, amazing features, and they're relatively easy to use. You're actually on a Shopify website right now, either reading this blog, watching this video, or shopping our website. Here's a pro tip, GoDaddy often has coupons for their domain names. Just give a Google search for GoDaddy coupons and you could get your domain name as little as 99 cents. Here are a few free things to start and market your hair business. If you follow these steps, you will get much closer to getting your hair business off the ground. And if you don't have a big budget, this is definitely, especially for you. So. Sell hair with unlimited inventory by using drop shipping. Dropship Beauty Shopify is an app on Shopify. 
If you're interested in selling bundles, wigs, closures, frontals, and all other items that you see on private label extensions, then you could probably imagine how much it will cost to have all of these in inventory, right? So this is where the magic of dropshipping comes in. The Dropship Beauty app, it will make setting up your hair store super duper easy. You're gonna simply install the app on your Shopify account, then you're gonna import the products into your online store. You can buy at the dropshipping price, sell at the retail price, and keep all the profit. You set your own prices, you choose what you wanna sell, and you never have to worry about shipping and packaging. Sounds amazing, doesn't it? Yeah, we built that app too. You also wanna sign up and register your social media accounts. This one is super duper easy and I know you know how to do it. So make sure you sign up or create pages on all streaming social media platforms. The social media platforms include Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, yes, Snapchat, of course, TikTok, and even Twitter, and all of the new ones to come. Setting up accounts, it shouldn't take too long and it won't cost you a dime. If you wanna keep notifications and your emails separate, use your email address to register the accounts that require an email. Here's another free marketing tool. Write blog posts about your products, services, and your business. Blogging takes some time, but hey, at least it's free. Blogging is excellent for your business. Actually, what you're watching right now is from one of our blog posts that's helping our clients, hopefully even you. That's great, right? But I know the first thing you're thinking is, but I don't know what to write about. What do I say? Yeah, I get it. Writing can be pretty challenging, but I recommend starting with what you know. The more you write, the easier it will get. You can also use the free Shopify email marketing tool. In 2020, Shopify launched its email marketing service within its platform. It's less advanced than some high-tech email tools, but you can get started for free at 99. Some free tools are more basic than advanced ones, which cost a lot of money. But you know what? They are often a lot easier to use. If you're just getting started and selling online, then this is all you need to get started. Then you wanna set up your credit card processing using Shop, Pay, and PayPal. You must have a way to collect all of your payments on your website. If you're using Shopify, it's super easy to do so by setting up a Shop Pay account. Setting up is easy. You go to settings, then you go to payments, and then you enter in your banking information. They might even ask for some additional information from you via email to make sure that you're legit. This follow-up is common as you're taking people's money over the internet and they need to make sure they reduce fraud. Also, start building your relationship with PayPal. Shoppers love and trust PayPal. You might see social media posts about how horrible they are and how they hold their money, but this breakdown is happening because they haven't learned how to build a good relationship with them. If you wanna learn more about this subject, please check out our video about processing payments for hair extensions. Another free marketing tool is gonna to be to add the Facebook pixel to your website. The Facebook pixel is a piece of code added to your website and it lets Facebook track everything a website visitor does on your website. I could go on and on forever about how amazing this is because you can create highly targeted ad campaigns once you've had the budget. This type of paid advertising is way bigger than just boosting a post. It only takes a minute to create a Facebook pixel after you've made a Facebook business page for your brand. Once you've acquired the pixel number, you can copy and paste it into your Shopify store by going to sales channels, then you click on online store, then you go to preferences. Don't wait to do this. Facebook will start building a custom client base profile based on your visitors. It will make advertising so, so much easier, especially when you're ready. Also, you can create YouTube videos for your brand for free. Creating video content should include tutorials, product videos, how-to videos, and so much more. If you need to learn about styling and coloring hair, you can also partner with a local hairstylist. You can get some photos of your brand at the same time as well. 
Like blogging, you can start with the topics that you know and that you're comfortable with and build from there. YouTube is the second largest search engine next to Google, so make sure you utilize it. Now, let's get into SEO, which is search engine optimization. You wanna optimize your product pages and descriptions. So this is gonna be by the title tag and meta description. Write blog posts that link to your products, get other websites to link to yours, and the list goes on. SEO is a long-term project and you should acquire some basic knowledge on the subject. And I'm sure you know, there is literally nothing better than free traffic from Google. Here is our meta description and meta title for the Brazilian Bodywave Bundle details. Designing a logo on Canva or PicMonkey. Oh my gosh, for free. We are huge fans of both online design programs, Canva and PicMonkey. They make it super easy to create great graphics and logos, even flyers. Keep your logo clean and straightforward without too many graphics. This design strategy makes it easier to remember and place on websites, print on t-shirts, and so much more. If you wanna invest a little more into your logo, which is gonna be essential at some point, you can check out the logo design service at Private Label Branding. Our sister company is dedicated to helping you build your hair business. You can also design graphics for your social media using Canva. Yes, Canva again, that girl. It's really a tool that you need to learn. I use it almost every single day, even when I'm teaching. Canva has thousands of design templates for your social media and any other design project that you're working on. It is super duper easy to create professional looking graphics quickly. Now let's get into some optional paid tools, services, or marketing ideas. If you have the budget, don't be afraid to pay the money in order to increase your marketing exposure. Now let's talk about branding items or your labels. Do you want to make a memorable first impression when your products arrive at your consumer? Yes, this can go a long way when calculating the perceived value of a product. So private label branding is the place to find everything that you need to make your brand look better. The custom printed hair extension bags have been a massive hit for so many years. The bundle tags also add a little razzle dazzle and is super duper luxurious, especially when you apply them to your bundles. If you have the budget for a little extra, then consider some custom branding. Now let's get into our advanced email marketing systems. Our favorite email system at Private Label is Clavio. It has a learning curve, but it can definitely help you get more sales with automated follow-up emails and advanced tools. Once you start getting a lot of subscribers, the cost of this can begin increasing rapidly, but don't let that scare you away. The return on the investment is fantastic with this program once it's set up correctly. You also wanna spend a little coin on setting up SMS marketing. There are a host of SMS, which is text marketing tools, that integrate with Shopify. Text messaging is a very powerful tool for recovering abandoned carts, promotional campaigns for sales, and staying in touch with your customers. Everybody is always on their phone. Unlike emails, you never miss a text message. The open rate is what makes it so popular with marketers. So what's the catch here? It can get expensive. Texting usually costs about two cents per message. So to send a list to 10,000 people will cost you about $200 to send that one single message. So if you decide to go this route, make sure your texts are good and worth it. Also, we can pay for Facebook and Instagram ads. Remember earlier in this video, I talked about the Facebook pixel? Well, this is where this comes into play. You will wanna create your audiences based on your visitors and then create an ad campaign targeted towards those people. I highly suggest starting with retargeted ads. The return on the investment is excellent. Also, don't spend too much. 
Give Facebook some time to learn from your audience. Spending just $5 a day can go a super long way. You can also print handout business cards. Yes, I know what you're thinking. This is an old school approach, but having business cards is key to every single successful business. Make your business cards with all your business contact information on it, including your social media handles, your email address, and your website. You can also leave your cards at various shops and stores if they allow you. Simply passing out business cards, they can generate a lot of monthly sales. Do you want to win in your business? Be creative. Don't be afraid to hire an influencer. Influencer marketing is super big, especially today. It is really big. Some brands like Gymshark, they've built entirely off of influencer marketing. Beauty Cloud is an easy way to hire an influencer to promote your product. If you need to instantly hire an influencer, check out the gigs featured that work similarly to Fiverr. And trust me, you do not need someone with a million followers to promote your brand and reach success. Start with influencers with the following around 5,000 to 15,000 and get more targeted results. You can also do a product giveaway on Instagram. Giveaways that still work. Everyone loves free stuff. Hello. You can run many giveaway campaigns to increase your brand awareness, your following, and hopefully your sales. I recommend having tasks like Facebook retargeting set up before running a giveaway that could send out cold traffic with people to your website. Cold traffic are people who are unfamiliar with your brand. This way, they will continue to see your brand over time with your ads and hopefully make a purchase. Also, to be legit, you are gonna have to register your business as an LLC. Yes, getting your business set up legally is essential. It is easy to register for LLC in your state. This process will help keep your business finances and your personal finances separate. So here are a few quick steps. Number one, you're gonna register your LLC with your state. Number two, you're gonna sign up for a tax ID with the IRS. Step number three, you're gonna set up a business bank account. Registering an LLC generally costs around $99 to $150. Getting a tax ID and a business bank account is free. You also can collaborate with the stylist. So you're gonna wanna provide hair for the stylist that they can use for a tutorial. I mentioned earlier how creating content for YouTube and social media is super duper imperative. Often in our Facebook group for starting a hair business, I hear people wanna avoid being in front of the camera. I get it, it's definitely not for everyone. So to get the most out of the strategy, I recommend the following. You absolutely wanna capture as many photos and videos as possible. You wanna get the stylist to tag your business in all of the photos. Make sure that the model posts pictures and tags the business as well. You wanna post the video on your YouTube channel and your Instagram. Not all stylists sell hair. If you find out that they don't, you could also form a business relationship where you give them a commission for the clients that you send to them and maybe that they send to you. The stylist will be super happy knowing that their client won't bring in junk hair from a beauty supply store. It's a win-win situation. Also, we can buy a professional theme for your website. The free themes that come with most platforms are enough to get by when you're just starting. But if you wanna step it up a notch, you wanna amp up your game, you will wanna buy a premium theme. They generally have many more features that would allow you to expand your business and your design online. And if you don't wanna worry about any of that, you can always purchase a website ready to go from our sister company, Dropship Bundles. We have a variety of Shopify hair business and WordPress hair business website available and it will be all set up in about just a week. You're also going to need to spend just a little money buying samples for your business. Having a sample kit for your business works. A sample kit is a way to showcase the quality and the texture of your hair without having to walk around with the full bundles. Potential customers, they love to see and feel the different hair textures so they can make the right decision when they're choosing their next hairstyle. Not everyone can afford one bundle of every single style and texture of hair extensions. And this video is all about a budget. 
As your business continues to grow, you want to consider having more samples of hair. When ready, you can order wholesale bundles from our sister website, Private Label Wholesale, for additional savings. Selling hair extensions is possible. We see numerous people doing it, so that means that you can do it too. And yes, even on a small budget. The key is to keep your costs low and your motivation high. Do you have any questions about getting started? Please feel free to leave a comment down below so we can get those questions answered for you. I hope this video was super duper insightful and I hope you're inspired to start your own hair company for $100 or less. Please like, comment, and subscribe and do your girl a favor. Share this video with one of your besties. I can't wait to see you guys in the next one. Peace out.